Let's begin with a word of prayer and we'll move right along into today's lesson. We thank you, Lord, for this time we have to learn and grow. We seek to do the best we can and add to what we know. We love you, God, with all our hearts and to others' love we show. Pleasing you is our goal. Now to our lesson, we should go. In Jesus' name, amen. Respond to School Academy, this is Mr. Lamb. I will be walking you through fifth grade mathematics, week number seven and day number one. All right, so today we're going to be talking about the concept of percentages again, which I know that you'd learned before in third grade and fourth grade. So when we're talking about percentages, what does that really mean? Well, the word percentage itself means percent. Okay, so this is per cent, which means one out of 100. This word cent over there refers to 100. Well, so anytime we're talking about things relating to percentages, it means that that number is going to be the numerator. So when I talk about 25%, which this is the symbol for percentages, well, that means 25 out of 100, or 25 divided by 100, right? So if I talk about 50%, well, what that means is 50 out of 100. All right. Um, if I talk about 75%, for example, 75%, well, that's going to be 75 out of 100. Now, what does that really mean? Well, let's assume that we have 100 squares like this. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, five, six, seven, eight, <laughs> eight, and nine, and ten. So let's assume that we have ten rows down this way, which may be broken down into one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Well, there are 100 squares in this big box over there. So you got 100 squares if you were to count all the way. So when I'm talking about 75%, that means I'm gonna get 75 of these little squares shaded. Well, that's exactly what it means. When I'm talking about 25%, I'm talking about getting 25 of these squares, little squares shaded, all right? When I'm talking about 50%, I'm talking about getting 50 out of 100 squares shaded, all right? So that's how to help your graphic with regards to understand what percentages are. All right, so uh, there are gonna be exercises over there. So for example, how many squares are shaded in brown? Well, that's uh, page number 60. If we were to count it, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Well, there are 10 squares, 10 brown squares. All right, there are 10 brown squares. And what percentage is that going to be? Well, that's going to be 10 out of 100, which is going to be equivalent to 10%. Right. That's what it means over there. Um, how many squares are shaded blue? Well, if you were to count it out, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Wait, are, there are going to be 35 blue squares. Uh, squares. All right, so what percentage is that? So that's gonna be 35% or 35 divided by 100, all right? So take your time to take a look at the exercises on page one, uh, page number 60 of your workbook uh, to see additional content to retain this concept a little bit better. So we talked about percentages over here. What is a percent? Well, percentage is just talking about some parts out of 
100 equal parts. All right. Did you get something from it? I sure hope so. Well, thank you, boys and girls, for joining me today. Remember, God cares about you, and so do we. Bye-bye. Your hero's body, and as you study with heroes born.